Hello. Hi, Peter. Hello, Joachim. Servus. I hear that you're interested in the thermal imaging camera. That's right. Thermal imaging cameras are just so much more affordable now. Spot on. This got me thinking that I might consider buying one myself. Okay. But I'm not exactly sure about the benefits I'll be getting. Well, I'll be very happy to tell you. This will be easiest if we apply the advantages directly to your own project. We'll go through the application step by step, and I promise you are going to be blown away when you realize just how much this thermal imaging camera can do. So, let's go in. In we go. Okay, Peter, so this is the new thermal imaging camera, the GTC 400C. If you look here, you can see the small battery adapter. Cool. And here you also have the option of working with our 12 volt system. You know what? That could be the exact same battery that's in the cordless screwdriver. Give it a try. And there you go. If it's, it's all about compatibility. We have a really robust housing with IP rating, and then there is also the extremely sturdy keypad. Okay. If we look on the back, we'll see this red protective cap. This here is the real image camera, and this here is the infrared sensor. And this is how you launch an image-in-image -image function. But I'll show you that later. The connection for the micro USB cable is on the side. So that's for connecting up to the computer. Exactly. What's even cooler is that you can transfer data over to your smartphone or tablet via a Wi-Fi hotspot. That's really handy, because I could send images straight to my customers, and they could then see what the problem is right away. And when it comes to documentation, I'd recommend making use of the Bosch Measuring Master app. You'll then also be able to make further edits to data if needed. Yes, that sounds great. I'd really love to try it out now. Come on then, let's go. So, Joachim, we're looking to modernize the whole house, so I need to check every room for thermal bridges okay. to make sure that the radiators aren't emitting heat for nothing. That makes sense. Exactly. And in this room here in particular, take a look for yourself, I reckon that the old roller shutter box is going to be a problem area. It certainly looks that way, yes. However, I'd need some proof of this to show my customer. Okay. Perhaps you could help me here. That'll be our first use. I'll pass the GTC over to you. First, you need to open up the protective guard on the front. Here? This flap needs to go up. Up. Exactly. Then the lens is exposed, and then you turn the device on here. Okay. The camera will start up now, and it doesn't take very long at all. And then you're ready to point the camera at your roller shutter box and start scanning. Oh yes, you can see the blue points really clearly. It's really obvious that cold is getting in there. Exactly. Press the large red button at the front. At the front? Yes. And then you'll have a record of your measurement results. Now it's really easy to view the results, and you can even zoom in on a real image by pressing this button here. This one? That's right. Press the arrow button here and you'll see the real image. That way it'll be easier for you to show your customer where exactly you measured. The next step is to save what we've done. In other countries, they have the exact opposite of this thermal bridge issue with air conditioning systems. In practical terms, it's the same problem. So the heat is getting in. Exactly, then the heat comes in. That's right. One more thing with the heating. Uh, I bled it earlier and believed that it's all working properly. But we can check that now too. That would have been a good opportunity for you to record the comparison of before and after. So your customer could see what a good job you've done. Never mind, but that's something you could have done. But now let's follow the same steps as before. Just press the button. Yes, start scanning like before and then save. And you can look at what you've saved to the memory right away. Looks good. Yes, that's fantastic. Here in the bathroom, I've installed underfloor heating, and I'd like to use the device to check that it's all working properly. No problem. Just start the device up, and there you can already see the heating on the display. Then we'll quickly use the Wi-Fi hotspot to send the documentation over to our Bosch Measuring Master app. I see. Straightforward process takes no time at all. And you know what's really good? What's that? For the door stopper, I can measure exactly where the gaps are so I don't encroach on anything. That's just as easy to do. Now, Joachim, you might be getting a whiff of something here. Yes, definitely. It smells a bit musty in here. I agree. There's a problem with damp in the walls. You can see it in this corner, for example. 
yeah. exemplar oh, yes. schauen. Du kennst eh schon die so now you know what to do. Festhalten. First we get scanning. Okay. And then we can look at the results. Mm -hmm. The most important thing now is that you can see the coldest point in the image here. It's very clearly a different color in the temperature display too. But then you can also see the temperature around this point in the wall, which allows you to make a comparison. We have a lot of pipes and this room is really cool, which causes condensation to form. If we don't get rid of this moisture through ventilation, we will start to see mold form very quickly. Exactly. And this mold can be really dangerous to the people living in the house. So we need to do something about this as a matter of urgency. Finally, Peter, I'd like to show you another possible application, and this is one that an electrician told me about. Take a look at this. This is what it looks like when you inspect a control cabinet and discover some overloading, which can, of course, then go on to be fixed. That's very interesting. It is, and it shows once again just how versatile our GTC 400C is. So, Peter, we've had a good go with the thermal imaging camera now. What's the verdict? I think it's amazing. I really had no idea that it would be possible to do so much with one device. I told you so. I'm just thinking back on everything we've done. Fuse box, Nola shutter box, underfloor heating, basement, and the list goes on and on. But the best part is that everything's documented, the before and after, and saved on camera. Great for the customer, and it would make my life easier too. You're sure you're always on the safe side? Exactly. Great for me as a fitter, and I'd say there's a place for this camera on every building site. So now you will be able to recommend the camera in good faith? Absolutely. That's great. Thank you very much for giving me the chance to show the camera off to you. I wish you all the best with your project, and don't hesitate to get in touch if I can be of any further assistance. Thank you. And on that note, I'll say goodbye and good luck with your work. Bye.